Hello everyone and welcome back to another one of these screencasts. This is a super fast one. It's a super easy one. I'm sorry if I sound a bit American there, but it really is super, super, super duperly easy. So it's types of angles and it's memory. Okay, hopefully I'll give you some little bits and pieces that are going to help you with that memory, but different types of angles. So we, we can name angles certain things. And some of the easiest questions we can have on maths is, name this type of angle. So we're going to go through those now. The first one is, little uh, clue for you, is when we think of that, when we look at that picture, what do we think? We think, what a cute dog. And this angle is less than 90 degrees, and it's called an acute angle. Okay, so when you have one of those small angles, less than 90 degrees, we can say that's an acute angle. The next one is when it's bigger than 90 degrees but less than 180 when we have a picture of this we could say that this is obtuse okay obtuse so it's bigger than 90 degrees okay remember we're going from zero through to so we've got 140 degrees on this one and that is called an obtuse angle so anything between the range of uh, 90 to less than 180 equals an obtuse angle the next one, and I definitely make notes as we go along, so I'm sorry I didn't say that for a start, but draw these out, write down the names, this will really help you in your quiz. The next one is when we've got an angle that goes, and I haven't drawn it here, but it goes all of the way around like that. So this is more than 180 degrees, but it's not um, 360 degrees because there's another name for that one. This is called, and when we think of, of this picture, we think this person is very flexible, and this is a reflex angle, okay? Because it's not just, it's it's more than 180, okay? Reflex angle. Different types of angles. This one here, can we see it? Straight across. This is a straight line. So when we see that, we can think of straight line, and we should know that a straight line is worth 180 degrees. We can going from 0 right through to 180 that's called a straight line. Different types of angles. The last one of our set of angles that we're going to call. This one is all the way around and we call this one a full turn because we're going all the way around. So we've got 180 degrees plus 180 degrees. That gives us 360 degrees. So a full turn is worth 360 degrees and it's called a full turn. Now it's time for the quiz. So if you haven't made notes, I would highly recommend going back and making notes because all it's going to be is name this type of angle. Okay, name this type of angle. That's what the quiz question is going to be. So make sure you know them. Now, just to be clear, we're looking at this angle here. We can see this is the, the slightly bigger one. This angle here, the straight line. Ah, I told you one. I told you four was straight line. There you go. You got um, only four to do now. I'm sure you knew that one anyway. Pause the video, give them a go, come back and see if you've got them right. Really is going to be nice and simple. Hopefully you know them all. If you don't know them all, you do need to go back and watch and make notes. Hopefully you do. Here we go. So we've got an obtuse for a start. We've got reflex all the way around. Remember, it's more than 180. Obtuse is, is more than 90 uh, or 90 more. Uh, an acute angle less than 90. A straight line worth 180 and a full turn worth 360. Hopefully you got all of those correct. This hopefully has been one, I'm saying hopefully a lot, has been one of the fastest screencasts you've ever done. Until next time, make sure you take some notes, do a revision card. But it's been an absolute pleasure helping you with your maths today. I'm sure you've got better today. And every day you do these screencasts, you'll get better and better. And before you know it, you'll be absolutely smashing it. But until next time, thank you. Thank you.